Cardiovascular disease, uh, namely heart attacks and uh, strokes, uh, remain the commonest cause of death um, in Ireland. And if we know the causes, then it can be prevented. And for those who have already developed uh, cardiovascular disease, um, we can offer them a comprehensive uh, program uh, of interdisciplinary care, um, which addresses lifestyle, uh, controls risk factors, and prescribes and up titrates uh, medications to protect the heart uh, and circulation. The National Institute for Prevention and Cardiovascular Health um, has three uh, strategic roles. The first is to provide uh, leadership in scientific research to better understand the causes and prevention of cardiovascular disease. Secondly, uh, to provide education and training programs um, in all aspects of disease prevention uh, for health professionals. And thirdly, um, to develop and implement innovative uh, prevention programs for patients uh, in the community. It is the first institute of its kind in Ireland to be wholly devoted uh, to prevention of heart attacks and strokes. In terms of our current activities, firstly, in relation to research, we have just completed uh, the first and only national survey of secondary prevention uh, of cardiovascular disease. We worked with our colleagues uh, throughout the country in hospitals delivering interventional cardiology and district general hospitals to identify patients presenting with a heart attack. In terms of education and training, we are running three master's degree programs. The first uh, in preventive cardiology, which is led by Professor Gerard Flaherty. Uh, the second in obesity, led by Professor Derek O'Keefe. And the third in obesity, led by uh, Professor Francis Vanuken. These three master's degree programs are unique in the country and form the basis for a comprehensive approach uh, to prevention and control uh, of cardiovascular disease. And thirdly, in terms of innovative service delivery, uh, we are offering um, a comprehensive interdisciplinary prevention program in the community, led by nurses and supported by dietitians, physiotherapists, uh, pharmacists, psychologists, in order to improve secondary and primary prevention in the West of Ireland.